Now, your WLKY weather with meteorologist Daniel Johnson. Well, it's been a chilly day out there. Take a look at this gorgeous sunset. Just incredible colors out there. The sun actually officially set at right around 556. So that was about 15 minutes or so ago. And just a gorgeous sunset here. I was talking with our floor director, Dakota, debating which camera to show you because we have so many cameras that look fantastic. He chose this one. But you know what? There are so many amazing cameras. So I'm like, I'm just going to show both. Look at that sunset. Pretty orange colors there in the distance. And you can just see uh, the buildings in the distance as well. So a beautiful evening, a little bit chilly. It's 41 degrees, the dew point 27. Feels like 38, so just a little bit of a chill factor out there because of the breeze. And we're going to keep it quite chilly heading into tonight. 43 was today's high, 34 was the low. No rain, no snow, but we will be adding some precipitation to the rainfall gauge as we head into tomorrow. Some of us will pick up some snow too. And I'll show you our latest forecast snow map coming up in just a couple of minutes. Right now, much colder to the north across southern Indiana into the 30s. Uh, while we're right around 41 here in Louisville, a couple of 39s in Shepherdsville and Bardstown. So these numbers will continue to drop off. Notice the winds, though. They're mostly coming out of the east and northeast at right around 5 miles per hour. So the winds are light and they're going to stay light heading into the overnight. But we're tracking a low pressure to our south. We have some snow just south of Omaha. We have some rain down in uh, Arkansas, Louisiana, and that's all lifting north. It's all due to an area of low pressure, and that low pressure is going to hop on the jet stream here, and it's going to take a ride pretty much right on top of us or just south of us heading into your Sunday, and that will overspread uh, some precipitation into our area. And it will be in the form of mostly rain here in the metro, some snowflakes mixing in here in the metro late tonight because we are going to get close to freezing. So being that cold, we will see a little bit of wintry weather even here in Louisville, but that won't last long. It's going to develop late, probably arriving by four or five in the morning here. But just by looking at our overnight low temperatures, you can pretty much tell who's going to see the wintry weather and who's going to see plain rain. Notice Shepherdsville 35, Bardstown 37. So south of Louisville will be plain rain, period. But look at how cold it is across southern Indiana, right around freezing. So areas north and west will likely see more wintry precipitation heading into your Sunday morning. As we look at it right now, the metro mostly rains. Some snowflakes mixing in into your Sunday morning. A wintry mix of snow and sleet north and west. Then we dry out for the afternoon, and that's when we get up well above freezing up to 41 degrees. So we're expecting most of the main roads to be just fine, even across southern Indiana heading into Sunday. But there will be some side streets, untreated surfaces uh, north and west of the metro that could see some slushy accumulations. Uh, tomorrow's highs, upper 30s to the north, low 40s as you head to the south. Here's that detailed Sunday forecast. Notice the unsettled weather for the first half of the day. Starting as rain likely at 6 a.m., mixing with a little bit of snow here in the metro by 8 and then just back to rain, and then we dry out for the afternoon with temperatures reaching the low 40s. So let's time out that rain and snow. We're cloudy overnight tonight. Clouds build through the night. Here's the rain by 5, 6 in the morning. Even portions of southern Indiana most likely rain to start. And then look what happens. We start to see some snow changing over. The Ohio River is literally going to be the boundary here between rain and snow, and that continues heading into the early afternoon then it's quickly out of here and we begin to dry out. So how much snow? Not much at all. A dusting to maybe an inch, especially as we get some of the heavier precipitation falling. Maybe Salem, Seymour, Bedford could get close to an inch of some snow. Your seven-day forecast, we get a break Monday and Tuesday and then more impact weather Tuesday night into Wednesday. Drew and Lauren, right now, Wednesday systems looking like a bigger and stronger storm. Looks like most of us will start as snow Wednesday morning and quickly change the rain, but how long will it stay snow? That will determine, of course, I'll answer that question eventually uh, once we get more data coming into the Weather Center. But if it stays snow for several hours, we could get several inches before it changes the rain. So I stay was tuned. literally just thinking too, gosh, this has been a pretty mild winter. Yeah, it really has. You know, it started cold, mm -hmm. then it got mild. And we've just been stuck in this got, mild pattern. And then it got really cold. Really cold at Christmas. <laughs> With those minus 8 degrees. Yeah, but right now, stuck in a mild pattern, but that's changing. All right. Thanks, Daniel.